coach's primary mode of transportation for the week was this KC-135 aircraft. Not exactly the type of plane the coaches are used to. It is a refueling tanker designed to refuel other aircraft while in flight. I'm thinking there's no windows, so it's going to be a long, long flight with never being able to look outside. <laughs> look at this, it's going to be a long trip. <laughs> I'm thinking I got 264 Sudoku's. The first leg of the trip was the longest, over seven hours to Germany. Next stop, Ramstein. The accommodations on a KC-135 are military, not commercial. Some special seats were installed to make things a little more bearable, but not much more. The lighting is poor, and there is little climate control. While in the air, it is freezing cold on board, while on the ground, it can be stifling hot. It's definitely not designed for passenger comfort. You know, there's no flight attendants now. Okay, there's no, you know, what would you, your favorite brev beverage, there's no food service. When we took off today, it was 120 on the plane. I was actually one of the guys walking around to make sure everyone was okay. Because we have the little blower that, that blows cold air when, when it's hot and hot air when it's cold. We're actually blowing cold air in people's faces just to make sure that they were okay. Now, conversely, we're flying over originally in, I mean, it's 30 degrees in there. And, you know, you're, you got sleeping bags over you because, you know, you're freezing. So it's been quite, it's been quite an experience. About a mile back, it's starting to light up on us. So it's starting to come in, get them about 50 feet from the aircraft, clear them on in, and uh, show you some air fueling. While the aircraft is not designed for travel comfort, it is designed for a specific military mission to refuel other planes. So far, so good. And in one of the most unique experiences imaginable for any civilian, the coaches eyewitnessed this very dangerous yet routine procedure. Uh, half mile seems like a long way, but when you're in the air, it's, uh, it's, it's quite a bit. Thousands of feet in the air, traveling hundreds of miles per hour. It's pretty exciting. The plane was about 50 feet away. Now we're at about 20,000 feet right now. I'm laying down, looking out the back of an airplane, and we're going, I don't know, 500 miles an hour. It seems risky, you know, when you think about it from the ground. But as you're sitting there watching it, you can tell they're pretty good at what they do. The other pilots knew the coaches were on board this plane, and they had placed various collegiate logos in their cockpit so the coaches could see them. In football, a new first down is earned at 10 yards, 30 feet. These two planes were closer in distance than is needed for a first down in football, about 15 to 20 feet apart. Oh, I love football. I am really excited. I'm giddy like a schoolgirl, right? <laughs> Business as usual right on the U.S. Air Force. Sure, sure, sure. These coaches. I tell, I tell my guy.